wires still aren't working. The inline fuse keeps blowing, so I'm checking all the wires. Wire schmires. How does this swimsuit look? Focus, you two. It's Seersucker's maiden voyage. We need to see if she's seaworthy. I think you mean pond worthy. Not bad, right? We're still dry. <gasps> uh -huh, got it! Ooh, groovable yachting is my favorite kind of yachting. Beaches! of the tidal wave, uh, Peach's wave, the locket should be down there! <sighs> Thanks, Lila! Now, go big! Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> That voyage was going great until it got peached. Go for Polly. This is Lila. Hi. Hey, Polly. What's up, Lila? Hey, Shani. How'd the maiden voyage of Seersucker go? Not great, but I just installed an autopilot feature that should really help navigate waves in bad conditions. Time to test out the open waters. Want to go on a cruise Saturday? Giant waves? Uncontrollable sea life? Count me in! And I know just the place to go. Uh, welcome everyone. I'm Peanut, and this is the Pit Stop's third official Paranormal Fan Club meeting. Uh, please remember, there's a two smoothie minimum for club participants. Uh, oh, and uh, try the cupcakes. Now, did anyone have any paranormal experiences they want to share this week? Yeah. My mail carrier was late three days this week. Blamed it on blisters from his new shoes, but I bet it was ghosts. Or cobbler elves, or aliens, or Bigfoot, or Chupacabra. You're that Vlogger kid, Jesus. right? I am. I shouldn't even be talking about this. Government has been covering up the mystery of almost Dead Man's Island for years. I'm the last living person to know about the treasure, and I've got the map. But I'm not giving it up for nothing. My most valued possession. A bona fide Sasquatch hair! Deal! The island is cursed. Cursed! If you're brave enough to go there, beware that you'll be haunted by the almost dead man himself. Beware! <laughs> cursed treasure? Um, yeah! Nicholas? Nicholas! Huh? Hello? Oh yeah, I'm here. I was just thinking that this island is really, uh, cool and good for doing normal island stuff. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow? I have to start packing last week! Uh, I don't know, Polly. I've heard developers have been buying up all the islands around Littleton for swanky resorts and beach homes. What if we get caught trespassing? Come on, Shawnee. It'll be fun. I'm not so sure about this. Can't we just hit the pool instead? That way, there's an island that looks cool and totally not haunted. Pretty cool, right? As long as we 
cut through the waves, we're perfectly safe. Yeah, listen, does Nicholas seem to be acting a little strange to you? He always acts strange. Strange is his norm. Land ho! Check it out! I don't think we should do this. Islands have sharp rocks and steep gorges and poisonous snakes! Come on, think positively. Huh, haven't seen that before. Ooh. Oh boy. Uh. Polly, Polly, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Now, let's go check out this island. Go big! This beach is incredible. And totally randomly selected. <laughs> Time to explore, shall we? Not happening. I came here to do one thing and one thing only. Chill time. Polly? Not until I catch some waves. These waves aren't big enough. Or I'm not small enough. Tiny power! <laughs> Well, Shawnee, it looks like it's just the two of us. Which is why I brought enough reading for both of us. Do you want attack from Planet Nebulosa or the Sword of Brokatron? I want... Let's get going. I have a feeling you're gonna want to see what's on this island. Are you sure you know the way? This doesn't look like a path. <sighs> Listen, I've heard from a reputable and also very sketchy looking source that this island might be haunted. And I'm gonna get the proof for my vlog. Haunted? Really? <clears throat> this is Nicholas with Nicholas's Mysteries. I'm here with Shawnee. Um, hello? And we're on a secret island looking for the almost dead man who's gonna live out his eternal years guarding the island against intruders. What? But we're intruders! Not that I believe in any of that silly stuff. Don't worry, Shawnee. If we run into the almost dead man, I know how to handle him, I think. We're signing off for now. I need to be on the lookout for you know who. It's okay. I have a treasure map. It could lead to riches. Hmm. How can you be sure it's authentic? It looks old, all right, but the edges are so clean. Could be printed and not hand drawn. And. Oh, come on. Let's investigate already. I don't know, Nicholas. Messing with weird haunted stuff isn't really my thing. If there's no such thing as ghosts, you have nothing to be afraid of. Now stop worrying so much. I'm heading back. Those waves are totally tubular today. Fashionable teen yachting. Ooh, my new favorite vlog. Here comes a big one. Ready, dude? Are you sure this is the right way? Positive. Why? Because it seems like the wrong way. I have a keen sense of direction. But let's take a breather. My tootsies need some serious R&R. &R. Are we slowly moving downward? We are. And does this appear to be a large pool of quicksand? It does. Johnny? Nicholas? Polly! Go big! Come on, Lila! Polly! Lila! Almost dead! Johnny! Nicholas! Hurry! The fog is eating me! You mean us, right? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Oh, what to do? What to do? Can I make a suggestion? Of course. Do something! If you get that tree branch in, I got it. Hold on to this super tight. Got it! Thanks for the padding. Now let's get back to size and back to our trek. Go big! Go big! That's odd. What 
the... Okay, it's probably just like when it wasn't working for Grandma. What? The gears are moving the wrong way. Go big, Lila! Tiny power! It must be the paranormal forces on the island. I'm sorry, what? You know, maybe there's a legend about the almost dead man who guards the island who has paranormal haunting powers and... Whoa! Back up the paranormal train! Whoa! Why didn't you tell us, Nick? That's some seriously freaky stuff. We should get out of here now. Wait, if we left now, we would be nautical miles away from our only chance of getting normal-sized. Don't you see? This is all the work of the almost dead man. If we can find the treasure he's guarding, we'll find him, and he can fix it. It's probably a test. What are you talking about, Nick? This island getaway just turned into a let's get away from this island. Come on, Polly. Are you seriously considering not coming on this mysterious treasure hunt? It's the adventure of a lifetime. Besides, we need to find out what's messing with the locket. Okay, okay. I'm in. Ooh. If there are any rubies in this treasure, can each of you grab a handful? They'd be perfect for my summer jewelry line. I'm not convinced that Nicholas's paranormal hypothesis is true. Nonsense! I have proof. Unless you're calling my paranormeter a liar. It's going berserk! So much dark energy around these parts. It is beeping really loudly. Oh, we're getting close. Just down this path. Uber vintage digs! It would make the perfect backdrop for a golden treasure chest! And the almost dead man! Only one way to find out. Stay away! The island is haunted! Stay away! Did you hear that? Spooky much? Yep. Definitely passes my scary test. 100%. Something's fishy. There has to be an explanation for all of this. There is. The almost dead man is close. I can almost smell him. Okay. Ew. <gasps> Anyone else hear that ghostly cry? Yep, that's it. Back to the boat. You guys sail, I'll swim back. No, 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 no. We can't stay small forever. We have to keep going. <sighs> He's right. What the? Anyone want to ask him for directions? Weird. The path just stops here at the temple. There has to be a secret passage or something that leads to the treasure. Secret passage? <laughs> Things don't work in the real paranormal world like they do in your books, Shani. It's not like you just press the arm of this statue and then... together now. Wait a minute. Wait? For what? The almost dead man to eat us? There's no time to wait, Shawnee. No time at all. Lila makes a good point. I really don't think he'd eat us. That's a zombie thing. I think he's more of a ghost or a spirit-like person. I Whatever. We should leave now. Enough! Everyone, listen to me. I'm only saying this once. The force we're experiencing is a magnetic field. There has to be a magnetic force that's throwing off my compass, and it makes perfect sense that it would be interfering with the locket's metal compound gears. We need to find the source of the magnet if we're going to fix the locket, go big, and get home. Skeptical, but... I'm buying what she's selling. Me too. Help! Help! Holy! Hello! Where are you? Up here! 
electromagnetic crane. Shawnee was right. Don't let go, Polly. We'll save you. I'll try, but I'm losing my grip. We gotta get in the show. The Someone's coming. Well. Let go, Polly. We'll catch you. Ah! <laughs> Thanks, Nick. Saying, Come on, let's move. We have to hide! This way! Be afraid! <laughs> this is fun. Those kids are falling for it. It's perfect. It wasn't the cries of the almost dead man. It was whoever that guy is. Based on the wrinkled polyester suit, I'd say a car salesman or a shady real estate developer. It's foolproof. That vlogger kid will spread the word that this place is haunted, and no other builder will come near it. Who wants to buy a haunted island? I'll get the whole thing for a steal. It's more like we're stretching the truth and lying, right? It could be haunted. After all, they built the whole amusement park 50 years ago and never even opened it to the public before they went bankrupt. Don't jinx it. My island resort will be glorious, and I'm gonna be rich. And, as my favorite contractor, you'll get like, uh, 10% uh, rich. Amusement park? It's not an ancient temple after all. You should have seen how excited that paranormal kid was when I give him that old park map we found in the rubble. Thinks it's a treasure map? <gasps> my Sasquatch hair? That's him! Regardless, we need to get a head start on this junk removal so I can get my resort open before anyone else. But you haven't even bought the island yet. It's never stopped me before. Now move that junk! You were right all along. Sorry I didn't listen to you, Shawnee. It's okay, Nick. But listen to me now. We just need to get that locket off the magnet and... Can we speed it up? I'm visualizing a lot of money coming in from this resort. And the faster you work, the faster my imaginary money becomes real. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Shaman. After years of neglect, this area is unstable. We gotta take it slow. Nonsense, it's fine. Money, resort money. <laughs> Whatever. It's gotta be around here. Pick them! Okay, just like the speakers on the yacht, but opposite and completely more complicated. Right, that's the stereo. I have to short circuit the electric current leading to the magnet. I better do it myself. Now let's see. Sunlight! Whoa, that is high. 
Oh man, it's full of weeds, rocks, and other potentially ouchy things. Nicholas, the tap! Crank it! We need water! It worked! worked. Time for a slide! I'm totally loving Take Charge Daredevil Shawnee! about the fact that my outfit got wet just this once. <laughs> <laughs> Faster! <laughs> Woohoo! Shawnee, thanks for getting us out of there. <laughs> I know, she really is amazing. <laughs> A natural leader. And my hero. <laughs> thanks, guys. I'll call the Coast Guard to help them out. When we get back to Littleton, we can't risk getting caught. Smart plan. Ugh. I still can't believe I gave that greedy old lump my Sasquatch hair. Not my smoothest move. You mean this Sasquatch hair? She even dropped it on the beach. Shawnee, you're the best! Sasquatch 5! <laughs> <laughs>